Creating a Meaningful Life. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 501. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution-creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 51C3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable and regenerative and self-replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. This is our October 30th, 2022 edition of our weekly progress update, and today's topic is creating a meaningful life. And I want to talk about creating a meaningful life because I think that a huge number of people on this planet are unable to create a meaningful life even though they want to because they're too busy struggling to meet the basic foundational needs of survival. And, um, and it's hard to do something else when you're really struggling to just meet your basic needs. And so our project and everything that you see happening in the background of this video is really designed to address that. And we even did a whole lot of research before launching one community into like, what is a meaningful life? And what is fulfilled living? What is What are the foundations of happiness? And uh, if you search Google and you Google One Community Global and six human needs, uh, you can find our page about this topic. And the six human needs that we identified and um, really focused on as the foundations of creating One Community are certainty, variety, so certainty is like consistency and security, uh, resilience, if you're talking about communities, uh, variety, so diversity, uh, significance, connection, growth, and contribution. So those would be the six human needs. And those are the foundations of happiness. And the two of those big foundations are growth and contribution. But different people have different focuses on those for what they would define as saying that they have a meaningful life. And so we designed one community with the idea being that we would open source and free share everything that we created so that people who share different values or have different ideas of what a meaningful life is could create their own versions of one community and focus on that. Maybe a meaningful life is really focused on art and music, or maybe a meaningful life is focused on what we're focused on, which is world change and creating a difference in the world and ultimately leading to a sustainable planet within our lifetime and a world that truly works for everybody and simultaneously addressing the greatest challenges of our generation and all generations to come. Or maybe it's just about having a really beautiful place in nature. I mean, people can have lots of different things, their ideas of what a meaningful life is. Maybe a meaningful life is being able to spend more quality time with friends and family. And so for us, as I already said, it's about creating world change. It's about having life that's that's about making a difference in the world and making a, lot, a difference in our own lives. And those six foundational human needs, we really looked at each one of those and said, how do we address those? But the first thing to addressing those was making sure that we were able to address the foundational needs, the physical needs, the physical aspects of sustainability as a pathway to creating security and creating stability in people's lives so they have more time and more money and more energy to do the things that they want to do outside of that. And so talk about this each week. You know, we're creating the open source tools, tutorials, resources, and do-it-yourself instructions for all aspects of sustainable living. And that includes the physical foundations of sustainability, sustainability, and then the emotional foundations of sustainability, which we think are the real keys to a meaningful life. And so the physical foundations of sustainability are food, energy, and housing. The emotional foundations of sustainability that we've chosen to focus on because they meet those six human needs are fulfilled living practices, what we call highest good approaches to education, economics, and truer stewardship. And we're putting all these things together as an evolution of sustainability to show how we can meet those foundational human needs better and to demonstrate that once people have what they need, once they have these physical foundations, fulfilled and even more so once they have the physical foundations and these emotional foundations fulfilled we believe that it's human nature to want to give back to want to make a difference in the world and i think that our project is an example of this because in the 600 plus volunteers that have contributed to this project the number that have done so from a place of financial stress or you know trauma going on in their lives and still choosing to give back is a lot larger than you would think. It's a huge number 
of that 600 volunteers. You know, and then there's so many other people that we've had contributing to it, like myself, that I'm very fortunate enough to be in a place where I can contribute full time to this project and still be able to just work enough to be able to pay my bills, you know, and to constantly be able to give back. And there's all those people as well. And I, they, we want to take it to that next level. We want to create a place where people can come together with shared values of wanting to change the world, wanting to make a difference, and to be able to have the resources and the collaborative space, the cooperative space, to be able to do that times 10 on steroids, what we're doing right now, a whole new level of achieving that. you know. And so I look at what we've accomplished over the last decade, and it's amazing. And I think about what we would be capable of doing once we're on the property and what we'll do from that space and being able to open source and free share all the details and specifics and the tools, tutorials and resources, the do it yourself instructions to the next level, the video that needs to be shot, everything that we've been preparing for for the last 12 years, that is where this is all leaving, leading. And it's my idea of a retirement plan. It's like, I want to retire to a place where I can work with other people that share this idea that we can make a big difference in the world and how to do that and wanting to do that and a place where I can do that consistently till the day that I die because that, for me, is creating a meaningful life. And we want to share that. We want to share that. Because from our perspective, most people want to create a meaningful life. Most people want to. And in my experience as a holistic health practitioner, before I did this, I saw all the blockages and all the challenges that people were running into to doing that. And I realized that, hey, we can create a place that removes those challenges. We can create a place that supports people in living whatever their version of a meaningful life is. And if we can open source and free share that, it's a pathway to changing the world. It's a pathway to changing the world. And so this is what one community is all about. It's about I've said it before, selfish humanitarianism, selfish philanthropy. You know, it's about giving people a way to create a meaningful life for themselves. And at the same time, if it's built on the foundations of what one community is all about, highest good, food, energy, housing, and all these other foundations, or even just any one of those foundations, it's a step in the right direction for humanity because it's better than the traditional way of doing things in most instances. And so this is our idea for making a difference in the world. This is our idea for changing the planet. And we're presenting it and providing it in a way that offers something for everybody because it's modular. Everything that we're creating is modular. And the ultimate expression of what it is that we're doing is demonstrating the complete model as a teacher demonstration hub, sharing with people how to replicate everything that we're doing. And a teacher demonstration hub designed to teach people how to create additional teacher demonstration hubs. So we're not just teaching a person how to fish. We're teaching teachers how to teach fishing. We're teaching teachers how to teach fishing. That's the idea. And the metaphor for fishing, in this case, what we're talking about is how to build completely, radically sustainable environments that are foundations for creating a meaningful life in the way that works best for anybody. Because it, through the foundations of sustainability, food, energy, and housing, it eliminates the bills that most people are under and through the open source education model and the highest good economics model, you know, and the fulfilled living model, it removes the stressors, the traditional stressors of life while simultaneously meeting those six foundational human needs, all of them, to create a way of living that I've said over and over and over again, but is objectively, it's, it's based on objective research designed to demonstrate a way of living that most people will consider to be are superior to the way they're living right now and making easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrating is attractive enough so the idea will spread its own and we can create a better world for everybody. This is what one community is up to. So if that's exciting to you, thanks for watching the end. Like, subscribe, follow our project, share our project, tell other people, get involved if you want. Visit our helping page if you'd like to get involved. Like this video, add a comment if you'd like to just support us in the easiest way possible. Um, you know, share this video. Uh, stick around for another couple minutes if you would like to see the bullet points for all of our, uh, all of the uh, major components of our project. And we got a new video. So if you've watched that before, check it out. There's a new video in there now. And um, yeah, thanks for watching the end. Until next week, we will, of course, keep on, keep it on. Let us know what you think about the new ending. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, 
do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. Thank you.